guys. It's me. We should do lunch next week. If you're watching this, then you're looking at potentially the last toaster chin video, the real last one, hey not the girl, one, what's going on? not the horizon, the the one episode of Horizon that I did with my wife. I don't have anything else. I have half a doomsday video in case hey, how you doing? I can manage to get everyone together. Nothing's really going on. You know. No, not really any closer. But I made the Dean's List in school. That was pretty cool. We're still saving to move. It's the end of summer. Kids back at school. But that's okay. We'll get there. But right now I should focus. And this just isn't very sustainable. But who knows? Maybe I'll get an itch. I mean, just being here in story mode is making me kind of want to get back to this. I just finished four on PC and got 100% in all of them. Now there's rumors that six won't be out until, what, 2023, 2024 now? Trying to stave off playing this after 100%ing four. And I kind of want to play it. Yeah, but not right now. Okay. Not right I now. It's been fun. You know? Hey, what happened to that beer you owe me? <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds good. I actually just watched what you're about to watch just now. And I didn't even... It was going to be an episode of this. I was trying to 100% this. Um, and I knew this episode. I think I mentioned it a while back. But... I picked it out first try. And listened to it about 40 minutes long. And, uh, it's good. Maybe I'm biased, but I was actually kind of entertained. I actually chuckled a couple of times. It was a little insightful. And I liked it. And so I thought, maybe this is a good one for us to end on. But like I said, I, I'm looking at this, I'm like, I kind of want to play oh, the story. I... But not right now. I'm getting everything I want to say out right now. Once I'm done here, I'm not going to have anything to say. I'm not ready to make episodes of anything. But, not to give anyone hope, even though there's nobody watching. That's the whole point. I don't know. I might want to just do some smoke screen. Just for posterity. Maybe I'll finish this. I won't delete the rest of the footage just yet. But in the meantime, 
as a goodbye. At least for now. Uh, I will present to you an episode of Smokescreen Grand Theft Auto V that I was going to call You Can Skip This One. Ironically. Enjoy. Welcome to Smoke Screen. <laughs> the delivery. <laughs> I loved that boat. Uh, I just had a. What? What is this? Stock trading. Yeah, I've, I've got a page for that. I'm gonna try to manipulate the stocks later. Um, I don't remember what I was saying. I think what I wanted to say. The, oh no. Yeah, who's this? Trying to it's talk. Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. The bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do is your bro business, twice bro. in the same sentence. Anyway, Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. Oh, I can't now, go into the menu. My shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll Whoa. be in touch if anything oh. comes up. Oh. shame. Let's see. Here. Oops. So you're gonna drive into me? Oh, you know, we do have one of those. We're gonna go to therapy. I do believe. Uh oh. Don't touch me! Oh, you don't have to call to tell me that. Not you, the Dieter Sack store detective. There's been a misunderstanding. I need you to help clear it up. <sighs> yes, oh, fine. Now you want me. All right, I'm coming. In the middle of the freeway. We're gonna be doing a lot of side missions, I think, today. I'm not sure. Whoopsie! Yes! She's your wife. Don't be a jerk. I keep losing the plot. Like, I, I was gonna say something. I don't know. I had a lasagna today. Was I gonna talk about that? Like, I just ate. Can you hear it? I don't know. like, ooh, lasagna. <laughs> and I was like, oh, neat. No, oh, that didn't help. And, uh, I was cognizant enough to be like, oh, no, 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 I shouldn't eat all of this. At least not all at once. So, you are not helping, Amanda. My god. Killing me. Like, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Sounds like such a like Bruce Willis type. Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. Come on, come on, come on! Relax. I don't know I if I'm making this. any sense. It's been a little while. But yeah, I was, uh, I was like, nah, I shouldn't need all that. Relax, I got this. Oh my god. Kill me. I'm taking an 
anti-anxiety. You trying to kill me back here? You got it. it. Are yes. they gone? Of course they're gone. Who are you talking? Of course they're gone. Come on, I'll take you back to the house. Great! We'll inconspicuous! Try to get out of the way. What? Then I have everything I want, so why am I stealing? Oh, my lips are sealed. Because if you say that, I'll say the same to you. I'm not saying anything. <laughs> I'm just doing my best to keep us oh out of jail. Oh my god. Are we going home? I mean, who are you to judge me? Oh, I'm not judging? No, not at all. You're loving this, aren't you? Oh my god, oh, yeah. like, I have so much better to, to do than to do any problems. Thank god. I didn't start the timer, fuck. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Should turn off the siren. <laughs> I'm just proud of myself for not eating all of it. Oh, that's where I want to go. I actually did this before because I came out of a... Uh, online. I was like, oh, um... What do I have to do? What is what is next? And I just wanted to take a look, and then that the phone call, and then the Amanda thing. I just wanted to get a haircut for Michael. <laughs> like I was like, oh, you know, start the next one with a with a haircut. That'll be nice. And uh, then all that happened. So. Have a seat. Uh, like someone to know come on, they want. Franklin went. I really just kind of imagine him like that doesn't look good. Mm -mm. It does, that yeah, like that just looks painted on. The beard's not bad, but he just doesn't really seem the type to have a beard. He sounds like he'd be this kind of gangster, like, that you might have seen on The Sopranos. And that's like a Michael Madsen cut. They both suit him. But I feel like he'd be more clean cut right about now. I love yeah. the outfit you have on today. Gorgeous! I really got distracted by <laughs> the haircut. I don't. Uh, I told you, like it's been a while. Bye bye, beautiful. Okay. We have the shrink. Yes. Let's do that. I thought I was gonna have to crossfade. And be like, oh, I'll just, I'll just open, sh I'll, I'll open that footage that I caught in Share Factory. And then I'll crossfade to live footage. And, uh. Then I actually realized I only cap uh, captured the phone call. I was like, oh man, what am I going to do? But then I realized, uh, but then I just loaded the save. That wasn't really interesting. <laughs> Sorry. Um, a kid asked me today, no, not asked me, she said to me, uh, Dad, when I'm older, I'm going to watch your videos. 
And I was like, I don't know, you might not think I'm cool anymore. And oh shit. He just stole my bag. Keep running, asshole. Keep running. <laughs> uh oh, bitch. Get back here. Don't try to play hero, man. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Gotcha. Jeez! <laughs> My god! That was insane! What a weird mechanic. If you dream of stolen item, you can... Here you go. Oh, yeah, God. take it. I'm not even from here. Thanks so much. Oh, we... Red to the fence. So strange. Uh, I don't have a car anymore. I don't know where, where I left it. <laughs> gotta take a new one. Damn. Looks like I can request it. No. Fuck. I got a therapy appointment! <laughs> no! <laughs> I gotta run to the beach! <laughs> uh, she said, um... I'm gonna, when I'm older, I'm gonna watch your videos. Can't believe I'm talking about this. <laughs> Just running down the freeway. <laughs> um, I said, I don't know. You might be like, you might think I'm not cool anymore. By the time you get old enough to watch them, it, Jesus. <laughs> she says, uh, How can I think you're not cool? We're family. And I was like, Damn. It's pretty awesome. Like, you know, sometimes I'm like, oh, am I doing a good job? And then, I don't know, maybe it's just her being a kid. But I like to think that I had something to do with that, so. Come in, Michael. Thanks, Doc. <sighs> Hi. Been? Good. Things been good. No. Actually, things ain't been good. Things been a far fucking way from good. I've been uh, acting out. That's what you would call it, I think, right? Acting out. So what exactly has been the problem? I'm not uh, good, Doc. Not good no. at all. I'm sorry to hear that. Tell me. I just... I've been caught up in the bullshit, Doc. You know, ever since I pulled this Mexican's house off a hill, it's been nothing um, but killing, robbing. That was like yesterday, I wasn't. <laughs> I even got a new one, too. This kid. I don't know, he's got similar proclivities. You know? Oh, God. Now everything's out of control. And if it's not by choice, I just. My life just got away from me. That sounds a lot like denial, Michael. This is really worrying. So, any other violent urges, friend? Therapy is good. Yeah. You know. Even on the way over here, I think I killed someone. And you know what? I did kill someone. <laughs> I'm sick, Doc. I'm a sick, hypocritical fuck. <laughs> the guy that it stole really the purse. Which is why you should really bulk buy a batch of sessions. I mean, this guy is a scumbag. <laughs> He's just milk and Michael for his money. I don't have much. It's still the beginning of the game. Uh, I really just yeah. want to be happy, Doc. Whatever. It's okay. fine. Okay. And what about your sexual behavior? I've been a really good boy, Doc. Really good. Not one problem. I'm glad to hear that. Really glad. Keep working it. This is great. I just ain't myself right now, Doc. Not since my life went crazy. You're plainly Which, again, chaos. Well, was yesterday. <laughs> I'm not exactly enjoying myself. What I'm addicted to is not getting killed. But for some reason, I keep getting my ass in the situation. This is also a weird a little hard to avoid. thing what to add the people you to the game. Yeah, like, that's not for fun. 
What if we let the character go to therapy? Am I a psychopath who enjoys suffering? Huh? Or a sociopath who doesn't give a flying fuck about the rules? Come on, we've already had this conversation, right? I'm neither. I'm just a fat, washed-up jock who can't get his head around the fact that his high school football career didn't play out the way that he planned. The only way I'm content and, and competent is with a gun in my hand or a price on my head. You're very defensive, Michael. Do you <laughs> consider yourself a failure? Um... I pay you to listen to my problems. I'm rich. I'm miserable. Half the time my kids can't stand me. The other half, my wife is cheating. This on is me. such a weird mechanic. I'm pretty average. This is like really, basically like. That's the shot. Like the Hauser's writing, just like like super masturbatory. Like oh, we love story. <laughs> we love character insight. All we have time for. This is so strange. This is gonna be such a weird outlier episode. We should probably keep it this way. Like, we shouldn't do any story missions. So if you're this isn't for you, like I get it. You can skip. It's it's you can probably skip to the next one if you're just like I'm just in it for the story, not your 100% crusade. Okay, hey, I got my cop car back. Um, yeah, we'll try to keep it to that. Um, I think I got a no, 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 no. no. I think I have to go onto the menu because I want to go somewhere. Um, there, I'd like to go there. I don't remember what I was talking about earlier. I do remember that I was talking about my kid. And that I think I might have wanted to expand on that. I think that's one of the reasons I do this, you know? Like... People say... That when you lose someone... It's the first thing to go from your memory is the sound of their voice. You know? You know, you've got pictures and stuff. But that only helps you remember their face, you know? So... Yeah, I mean, I wasn't cool. You were right, I wasn't cool, but I did play video games and I did talk to myself and... I guess I left a record of my voice. At my nicest. I'm sure I wasn't always nice. Can you imagine though? Like, hey, hey. You never call me back the next day. like, how do you remember your dad? Well, I watched these old YouTube videos of him playing Grand Theft Auto while he was stoned out of his mind, and you know, <laughs> talking to himself. So I'm here because. I, uh, it's my favorite place in the world. Uh, I had a dream a long time ago, I think I talked about this, uh, where I died at the beginning of the dream. 
and you know normally that's the end of a dream but no for this dream I died at the beginning and then the rest of the dream was me in like this afterlife right and uh and it's like perpetually sunset and it's right by the beach waves are crashing it's rolling they're rolling and uh they're warm and colorful and it's really nice you know like that um and i was you know like i think you know we all have to die and that's why people believe in stuff like like they don't want to know that like that's it so uh i need to take take a second hold on um I was talking about the dream. Um, yeah, I. We all gotta die, and so like, there's gotta be this peaceful place where you can come to it. And I think that was the moment where I was like, if this is dying, it's not so bad. So like, and when. I'd always wanted to come to Los Angeles, and so when, when Lee took me out here, we went to the Santa Monica Pier. This is, which is this, and uh, I just felt it. I felt that feeling again here, and uh, we've been to LA one more time, and I said that's the one place I want to go. Like, I saw all my touristy shit the first time. Take me anywhere you want. It's got good food. But this is the one place I want to go. So. I really like it here. I don't know why I started talking about that, to be honest. But I do want to tell you about uh, what I felt this morning. Like, I came home from work at 6 o'clock in the morning. And I am looking over as I'm walking up the steps to my porch. And I see the hills off in the distance hey, with do, right? buildings and houses and trees like it's really nice and I uh I took my vape and I took uh, I went back out there I was like I'm gonna watch the sunrise for a little bit because Lee was still up and uh I, uh, I, um, just been there for a little while. I looked at it and I was like, you know, when I was younger, all I wanted was a house with a good view. And when I was a kid, that meant. Uh, you know, in the city, with all the city lights, tall buildings, you know, had to be in Manhattan, or had to be, well, you can't see it from here, but like, you know, like downtown LA, or, or, or no, 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 like, it had to be like Beverly Hills, because it had to be like just right above Hollywood Boulevard, where the buildings are starting, and downtown LA is not that far away, so it's not like, you know, like pinching a grape when you're trying to compare sizes what no <laughs> when you're trying to you know when you're like oh how tall does that look to you or I don't know what the fuck I'm saying <laughs> but 
point is, that was what it was before. And then it turned into this. You know. A view of the water. And, of course, it had to be Santa Monica. Um, there's the airport. I didn't realize you could see the airport from all the way over here. Like, that's pretty far. Um, whoa, really lost my train of thought there. Um, but now I have this house. It's an alright house. It's not a bad house. It's kind of a small house. I always wanted to move out and like get my own place because I lived in a in a spare bedroom that my grandmother had. And so like and then when Lee was pregnant, like we uh we lived in her room in her parents' house, which was even smaller than my room. And then finally we got this house, and I'm like, oh, yes, I can finally spread all of my things around. And then I got here, and I was like, oh, yeah, I'm moving in with somebody who also has things. All right, let's move. I know, I know. I've been doing this for a little while. So let's just go ahead and walk back and enjoy the night. Um... I can remember. What's up, dude? I, uh... We're gonna fast forward. I'm gonna be much further down this pier. <laughs> I wonder if you can hear that. There's a song playing out in the environment. I have no idea. Or if it's just waves and lights to you. Footsteps. Let's fast forward some more. Anyway, my house. We're back. It's, uh... It's... It's... Yes. Yes, sir. It's not a big house. But it's a serviceable house. But it's in a good location. You know? I'm just walking, man. Like, you grazed my ass. Um, it's in a good location where it's kind of on a hill but it's next to a much larger hill like a hiking kind of hill and uh... then we're on a hill and then it keeps going down a pretty decent curve that you can see down the street but then it, the, the earth curves back up all around us because there's like hills and I described it a little bit earlier but like the hills uh, with like trees and there's houses uh, up in the hills and and it's very nice there's like one building over there that must have a reflective surface because whenever I come home when the sun is rising it's reflecting the sunlight who's this? Oh shit, who is this? So I see alternatives to life, man, and death. And the interesting thing is that, well, life is cool. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, 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 um, yeah, I guess. What? All right, good luck with that therapy. Okay. So, man, I mean, I was sent here to 
Decent view. Like it's a small house. It could be a little bigger, but it has a decent view, and I think that that's something noteworthy. You know. I also noticed that I didn't have like all the houses on my side of the street have front-facing doors, like see the front of the house and you can see the door and then on the opposite side of the street all the houses have sideways doors where like you walk up a couple of steps and then turn and there's the door there's a parking lot I'm gonna have to take a car <laughs> um, I was like wow I've never what are the odds so like I wouldn't have ever had a sideways door. Just gonna have to. Yeah, I'm leaving. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Okay. I wasn't gonna be able to concentrate with that going off. Yeah. I mean, I guess if my kid is watching. Whew. Let's go. Let's let's go home. I don't think they'll even let you hear the commercials. They just cut the radio entirely, don't they? Because they're talking about n news right now. They're talking about the when we blew up the guy's head. Um, yeah, I... Uh, if she is watching, like... I know it wasn't always interesting. But at least I left a record of my voice. And you can be like, hey, this is my idiot dad. Like, playing one of his favorite games. And talking to himself. Like, I don't think I've said anything absolutely horrible on any of the videos. Elaine would tell me. And I'm pretty I'm pretty sure I haven't said anything like that I'd regret. So It's not always interesting, but uh, you know, hope you still enjoyed it. Can I go to? I mean, it really doesn't matter. Let's. It's gonna change the time of day, like to suit its needs. So, why don't we just say that's enough for now? Um. I hope I wasn't too scatterbrained. We're gonna get into it next week. This was, uh, this was an off week. I don't think it was terrible. Don't get me wrong. I don't think it was terrible. I just don't know, like, if it was... Great. I think we kind of got a little too deep about, like, the sunrise and, like, the view and... And, oh, my kid's so sweet. Like... So... I don't think it was bad. I just... We didn't do anything important... So if that's what you're look oh watching these for, just 
this was an okay one to skip. Because even if you guys aren't listening, maybe my kid is. Until next time.